Right, so welcome everybody. This is Oceanic Offensive. Uh, where kids, squids, and adults as well around Sydney have all come here today to splat the world together. Uh, all um, right. We have eight teams today. Uh, hopefully, you can hear me. Uh, just let me know if you can't hear me, and I'll just shut up. But. Um, Eight teams comprised of, I think, like, uh, we've got people here from Adelaide, New Zealand. Uh, we even got them from South Australia, Melbourne. Do we have any Melbourne people? Yes, we do have Melbourne people. Oh, my goodness. So awesome. these are people from all around Australia, even New Zealand. I think I would call this the first platoon major in Australia. Right, the uh, first really big platoon major. Yeah, I mean, we've, we've had people travel a lot further to be here and stuff, so... Uh, we are going to get underway soon. Our first match is going to be uh, Sea Slugs versus Bro, and the Sea Slugs are a sort of a newbie squad. So um, hopefully our uh, Bro team will go easy on them. I hope you all heard that. <laughs> For their, uh, their first uh, go at the game. Um, and uh, we are looking at. Let me just. Who's over. that one? We are going to watch uh, Angelo, I think, if I've got these set up correctly, which I bet I haven't. This one says four, so that is Angelo. I thought so, but we'll find out, because that, that's not Angelo's weapon. I'm gonna <laughs> Who's using the... oh wait, I don't want to give it away, do I? Oh yeah, okay, yep, here we go. Yeah. So we're going to be watching Angela, and... Uh, Where's these stage lists? Oh, stage lists. May I grab yep. this, please? Uh, so it's going to be uh, Walleye Warehouse Splat Zones. And I think Bro have elected to go with weapons weapons that they're not as familiar with. So uh, if you're looking at the weapon select, you can see that um, Angela has gone the heavy. I have never seen Angela use a refurbished mini splatling she, before. If you look at her splat net profile, the turf ink is just. Octobrush, and then maybe another Octobrush, <laughs> and then the rest is like less than 100k in everything. So, um, uh, so we actually have over on the left side, if you're watching in the webcam, these guys are getting instructions on what the objective are and how to play the game. So this is going to be a rude introduction to Splatoon for them, and we'll see whether they can uh, get a grasp of things in their first few games. Hey, let's switch to the quad view and see what they're doing as well. Sure. Cute moustache, thank you, thank you very much. Right, so the top left and top right are... No, no, your, your two on the left are yeah. our newbie squad, and two on the right are Bro. Uh, so we've got a Wyatt and Angela visible there. So if you look on the bottom left, we're actually having a bit of a pin in at the base going on while uh, Bro holds the point. Angela just whipped out the bomb rush. And oh gosh, oh, there ooh, there's go. an Inzuka coming oh, out. Oh my goodness. Oh, another team wipe for I, Sea Slugs. I, I, I feel the whole point of taking weapons you're not familiar with is defeated when you're just going to squash them at the spawn. Ouch. I hope they know, like, the extra alleys along the sides. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, yeah, map, map familiar. Here we go, we've got an ink strike going off in the top left. And we're striking the point. Ah, oh, there we go. Are they striking the point? They just try, decide to strike to try and get a bit of forward momentum here. And it is going to be a, uh, whoa, bottom right double kill from Angela with that with that splat laying. Somebody's camping them. They did not get the I message the whole, about... I think, yeah. They did not get the message about going easy. So that is... One point towards Blue Ringed Octolings. Yeah. And I think Blue Ringed Octolings today brought three teams. And you're watching the elite team today. So they've been seeded against our, uh, as our first match, up against our newbie squad. That's right, literally three of our teams today are going to be Blue Ring Octolings 1, Blue Ring Octolings 2, Blue Ring Octolings 3. I think they have a little bit of uh, inclusion from like a few pickup people in that, but uh, this squad is entirely the, the bro elite squad. Oh, they didn't choose the super pro ink brusher. Right. Alright, we're heading to tower control on Hammerhead. Ooh, this one's a tough one to get used to, especially if you're new to the game. I hope the Sea Slugs have actually played on Hammerhead Bridge before, because it's a really confusing map, especially for beginners. Or well, at least, uh, like, with I, I find sometimes ranked is a little less confusing than turf because you've got an objective and you like the objective That's is right. highlighted. So anywhere you go, okay, I'm gonna go towards that objective. With turf, it's sort of like it, everybody's everywhere, right? You got more fans, man. Let's go back to 
Otter fan okay, reporting in. Good morning. Um, hello, my people. Uh, splat, splat a tat. We're just waiting to go underway with our second game, right? That's right. We're just waiting for Bro Wyatt to get ready. Obviously, Boozler coming out, so Wyatt's practicing his charges today. Charger Bamboozler. I actually, um, I find it actually really hard if I'm going soft on people, actually getting back in the mindset to play again, because um, I, I just like going from, oh, it's really easy kills or they're being predictable to actually playing against people who know how to duck and weave and it, it really throws me off. So I'm oh actually hoping that maybe we're going to put Bro at a bit of a disadvantage for the rest of the tournament because they're going to start off with this nice, easy mindset. Oh my god. Okay. I hope they didn't hear any of that. Let's switch to quad view and see what everybody else is doing. Alrighty. So we're seeing somebody from... Uh, Sea Slug's trying to take up a sneak. Oh, they oh. got a kill. So oh, that's nice. Top, top left, uh, so green side is your is your Sea Slugs, and right side is um, is Bro. Um, I haven't got their names in there, do I? Here we go. Um, so to in Inep SCA in the chat, we've actually got a splitter on us right now. So we've basically got four capture cards, and we're all just getting them into one um, yep. thing. So let's see what's going on right now. Somebody's playing a sloshing machine Neo. It's got the Inzuka, which is pretty deadly weapon on um, Hammerhead Bridge because there's a lot of wide open space where you're going to be walking out in the open. And you might just not have enough time to swim away from an Inzuka shot. Ooh, um, okay, bottom left just got killed. Bridge, yeah, if you look at top right, uh, top left, sorry, you'll see that there is a push up on that bridge and there's two of them camping. And I think they've already won. To get to. Yep. So that's two games. We are playing best of five today because we uh, figured last time we finished a little early. Yeah, that's right. Um, so we've already got two knockouts from BRO. Let's switch back to, uh, is this the one? Yes, we can go that one. Hooray! Hey! Right. I move over to the right. There we go. Okay. Symmetry. Um, so it's another win for the Blue Ring Dr. Lings. And uh, we'll get to try Rainmaker and our newbie squad's getting a bit of an introduction to what Rainmaker is right now. That concept of, uh, it's really like a bombing run, isn't it? Um, I taking hear... Taking the bomb to the end. It, it, it's like reverse cap to the flag, but like bombing run in some games where you're trying to take the bomb to the enemy base. Um, Except I've... in this case, the bomb is also a gun. Right, so. it's like a really giant slow Inzuka shot. When you, f when you have the Rainmaker, you're extremely slow, you're glowing, you're really visible, but you've also got a massive tornado attack. That you can do if you charge it right. I'm gonna actually tweet this out because I think now that the stream is up and maybe we're not having audio problems, if you know, if there's any audio problems, just let me know. I'll link you the bracket in a second. Uh, right. But I will so, just tweet out that we're live. I shall commentate on this bit. So we're getting Rainmaker. Our newbie squad is getting introduced to Rainmaker by. Who is he again? I'm really bad with names. Uh, oh, uh, Nikasar is their coach. Nikasar is coaching our newbie squad. Now let's go to Quad View and see what they are up to. Yep. Are they all running ink brushes? Oh yes, I think there might be ink brush uh, nouveau. I can't see what um, what why it's running in the top right there, but that's my style. Yeah, but no one's as good at it as you, Otter. Oh, that, that's true, I guess. <laughs> um, Right, well, um, it looks like our newbie squad actually has the Rainmaker first, and unlike um, un unlike what we usually have in the lower ranks, they are actually going in the right proper direction. So that's actually a very good start for them. Uh, it looks like BRO has got the Rainmaker now. They're going to try to... Oh no, they're trying to go over the towers in mid. Uh, let's... Wyatt just got a splat. Uh, BRO takes the lead and they're going to take up the little ramp. It looks like they might actually dunk it this one. Wyatt oh, just got go. splatted. And there we go, here comes the Rainmaker. That and the dunk gets in. So that is uh, three, three points. Games. Yep. Was well, that the best of five? Um, the, it is the best of five. So that is the, the three games to bro. And uh, our sea slugs are heading into the loser's bracket. But I think. Uh, Hopefully they still want to play the game with us. 